I want to discuss a major problem that I have seen occur with men over the years, and that is that when they've experienced trauma for a long period of time or when they haven't had things go their way for a long period of time, it's very easy for them to fall into the trap of being a victim. Now, it's not to say that everything is necessarily their fault, but I think it's too easy for them to start blaming the world, blame everything's against them and it's everyone else's problem and not their own. And they avoid taking responsibility for their actions and doing something about it. Now, in integral eye movement therapy, which is an area that I have uh, specialized in, um, there is something called patterns of chronicity. And one of the patterns is something called being at effect rather than cause. And this is where essentially a guy isn't taking responsibility or a person isn't taking responsibility for their actions. And instead, they feel like that these bad things are happening to them rather than it necessarily being uh, a cause of their actions or lack of actions per se. So the problem then with this is that then these guys will go about their lives and just not do anything about it. And the problem then that occurs is that the longer they delay doing something about it, the worse it tends to get. And it's like digging yourself a grave and just knowing that you can get yourself out of it, that there's a ladder there for you to climb out, but you carry on digging anyway until the hole gets deeper and deeper. And that ladder is now nowhere near the top for you to climb out. So when guys are noticing these issues, you have to do something about it. You can't just let it slip or just ignore it. You have to be accepting responsibility and taking accountability for your actions if you want to get the best results in life. And the only way you can do that is by just getting on with it. But if you are struggling with that, then you have to consider the idea of getting a support system in place, whether it be turning around to friends and family and asking them to give you the nudge and motivation or the support that you need, or you need to consider going to a coach or a therapist. It just bewilders me that guys just don't think about the idea that if they actually put the hard graft into working on something that they want to achieve, then they will get the results. Now, the time that they'll get those results might vary from person to person, but again, that also depends on how long you've been digging that hole for. For some, they've had a great social life and then for them to work on an area of dating that hasn't been successful for them, they're gonna get that result faster than those who have probably spent years upon years complaining about their lives and not getting those results. And then when they finally start making those changes and they aren't seeing it. <laughs> Lily, go on, come on, you, you, come on, <laughs> come on. Deary me. Um, you're going to get those guys who, you know, they've delayed uh, working on um, their dating lives. And yes, it will take them longer because they have dug themselves a deeper hole that they are having to get themselves out of. And that could be that they've been, they've delayed making friends and socializing more. They've delayed actually making more positive changes with their physique and their diet or having hobbies and interests or getting a job that they actually enjoy. All of these things play a part in just your overall happiness and success in life. If you aren't doing something that you want that's gonna help you be happy, then you can't be sitting there and complaining about how terrible your life is. It's one thing if you've been taking action and you haven't been getting the results on your own, then there's, then you have, uh, as far as I'm concerned, you're allowed to make uh, a complaint or moan about it. But then also you have to rule out all of the other possibilities of like, you know what? I went to a coach, 
I didn't get the results that I wanted, or I tried to do this on my own and I didn't get the results that I wanted. At that point, then I respect people complaining about the problems that they've got. But if you aren't looking at solving the root of any issue that you have by taking responsibility and then taking action as well as accountability to work on those things, then they won't ever change for you. And it just bugs me when then you have people who will just complain about all this stuff but then when you ask them well what, what did you do to to try and change this situation or circumstance and they're like oh I didn't do anything that that's not gonna get you any kind of positive change and as far as I'm concerned if you're not looking to take responsibility for your action then you don't deserve to have people feel sorry for you you can't play the victim your entire life. And if you do, then no wonder that life is depressing for you and not going the way that you want. And sadly, that will turn men bitter if they don't accept that responsibility of doing something about it. So I don't mean for this to sound like a rant. If anything, I want you to see this as a really positive mindset that if you have got any problems, if you aren't happy with your dating life, accept it. Be like, you know what? I'm not in a great place right now, but I want to do something about it. What can I do? And I think that's a great statement or question to ask yourself. If you're not happy about anything, I'm not happy about this. I accept where I am, but what can I do about it? And you know what? I would love to hear in the comments, what is something that you are struggling with at the moment and what are you going to do about it? Now, if you are struggling to do stuff on your own, I do know people that I can certainly recommend for most areas, I would say, of, uh, of someone's life. But I am also a life coach, so I can help to hold you accountable on things, as well as if you are struggling to do new things because of previous negative experiences that you've had, then I can use my eye movement therapy on you too, and I can move this being at effect to being at cause, where you are accepting responsibility and taking action on stuff, rather than feeling like things are happening to you and it's out of your control and there's nothing that you can do. You can do everything and anything if you put your mind to it. So thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel if you can and look forward to another video coming out tomorrow.